What's going on YouTube, this is Oxvoxel and I'm here to give you my first impressions of Dirty Bomb. Dirty Bomb is a new free to play multiplayer first person shooter that is currently in beta. It was developed by Splash Damage who were responsible for creating the poorly received Brink back in 2011. From the little I've played of Dirty Bomb however I can safely say the game already plays a lot better than its predecessor. The game is fast paced and will punish you for a wrong move. That being said the gameplay feels smooth and the matches are very enjoyable. It's set in a post apocalyptic London. Go Team GB, and pits teams of mercenaries off against each other across an already wide array of maps in objective based game types. There are plenty of different mercs to play as in the game already, and additional characters have been added since its Steam release last month. You can select up to three mercs at a time to take into a match with you, which come in the form of a squad. You can pick from any of these three mercs to spawn as each time you die. The game really focuses on the team elements, as you even gain experience points for your account just for being near a teammate. The different mercs have a wide variety of abilities and weapons, for instance Sawbones is a support mercenary and could supply his teammates with health packs and has the ability to instantly revive a down teammate using his special ability. This is especially handy as helping up a down teammate usually takes you out of the fight for a few seconds and makes you a prime target. On the other hand we have the newly added Phantom who favours his trusty katana over his guns and can use his reflective armour ability to enter stealth and sneak up on enemies. Using a variety of mercs in your team is a great way to win a game as each individual can do their part towards the objective. With all the learning out of the way let's talk about money. I was sceptical to say the least about this game being truly free to play but I was surprised to find that it is. These mercenaries you start out with are more than viable even in intense matchups and there is a free mercenary rotation that lets you play as mercs you don't own for a while. All the mercs can be purchased using in-game credits that rack up quite nicely as you play the game more and more. All in all, Dirty Bomb is a fun, frantic FPS game that will make you laugh and cry all in the same match. I see people saying that it's pay to win, but I've played my fair share of pay to win games and this seems far from it, although it does remain to be seen in the future. If you haven't tried Dirty Bomb out yet, I'll leave a link in the description and it's certainly worth shutting down Call of Duty for an hour or two just to see what it's all about. We'll see if the game manages to spring onto the competitive scene in the coming months, which I truly hope it does, as I'd like to see how some of the pros handle the fast-paced action. As always guys, thanks for watching, and maybe I'll see you in-game.